Welcome to the Psychology and Physical Training channel. The power of now. The present moment holds immense power. It is the only place where life truly unfolds. By focusing on the now, we tap into a wellspring of peace and clarity. This is the essence of mindful living. Our minds often wander, lost in thoughts of yesterday or tomorrow. This mental time travel robs us of the richness of the present. When we are not fully present, we miss out on the beauty and wonder around us. We become disconnected from ourselves and the world. Being present allows us to fully experience life. We savor each moment, appreciate the small things and connect deeply with others. This presence cultivates a sense of gratitude and joy. It is the key to unlocking a more fulfilling life. When we are present, we are more attuned to our emotions and thoughts. We can observe them without judgment, allowing them to pass like clouds in the sky. This non-reactive awareness creates space for inner peace and clarity. It empowers us to respond to life's challenges with wisdom and grace. Obstacles to presence, distractions are a constant challenge to staying present. Our modern world is filled with stimuli vying for our attention. From notifications to social media, these distractions pull us away from the now. We must learn to manage these distractions to reclaim our focus. Overthinking is another common obstacle. Our minds can become caught in a cycle of worry and rumination. We replay past events or fret about the future. This mental chatter drowns out the present moment, creating anxiety and stress. Multitasking, often touted as a productivity booster, can actually hinder our ability to be present. When we try to do too many things at once, our attention becomes fragmented. We lose focus and fail to fully engage with any one task. The result is often less efficiency and more stress. Emotional reactivity can also pull us out of the present. When we are triggered by strong emotions, we may become lost in anger, fear or sadness. Learning to regulate our emotions is essential for cultivating presence. Mindfulness practices can help us develop emotional resilience and stay grounded in the now. Cultivating mindfulness. Mindfulness is the practice of paying attention to the present moment without judgment. It involves observing our thoughts, feelings and sensations. Mindfulness can be cultivated through meditation or mindful walking. Meditation provides a dedicated time to cultivate presence. By focusing on our breath or a mantra, we stay anchored in the now. Regular practice improves focus and manages distractions. Mindful walking involves paying attention to the sensations of walking. Notice the feeling of our feet on the ground and the sights and sounds around us. This practice brings us back to the present moment. Engaging your senses, our senses, offer a powerful gateway to the present moment. By consciously engaging our senses, we can anchor ourselves in the now. We can notice the sights, sounds, smells, tastes and textures around us. This sensory awareness brings us back to the richness of the present experience. Take a moment to look around and truly see your surroundings. Notice the colors, shapes and textures. Observe the play of light and shadow. Engage your sense of sight to appreciate the beauty of the present moment. Listen attentively to the sounds around you. Hear the chirping of birds, the rustling of leaves, the distant hum of traffic. Pay attention to the nuances of sound, the subtle variations in pitch and tone. Engage your sense of smell. Notice the fragrance of flowers, the aroma of coffee, the fresh scent of rain. Allow yourself to be transported by the subtle nuances of scent. Similarly, savor the taste of your food and drink. Pay attention to the textures, flavors, and sensations in your mouth. Section 5. The Art of Single Tasking. Single tasking is the practice of focusing on one task at a time. It is the antidote to the multitasking madness of our modern world. When we single task, we give our full attention to the task at hand, leading to greater focus, efficiency and enjoyment. Start by identifying one task to focus on. Eliminate all distractions, such as turning off notifications and putting your phone away. Give your undivided attention 
to the task, immersing yourself fully in the present moment. When your mind wanders, gently guide it back to the task at hand. Don't judge yourself for getting distracted. Simply acknowledge the thought and return your focus to the present. With practice, you will become more adept at staying present and resisting distractions. Single tasking allows us to fully engage with our work, our hobbies and our relationships. We experience a deeper sense of satisfaction and accomplishment. By cultivating the art of single tasking, we reclaim our focus and enhance the quality of our lives. Section 6. A guided breathing exercise. Find a comfortable seated position. Close your eyes gently. Bring your attention to your breath. Notice the natural rhythm of your inhales and exhales. Inhale deeply, filling your lungs with air. Hold your breath for a moment. Exhale slowly, releasing all the air from your lungs. Continue breathing deeply, focusing on the sensation of each breath. As you breathe, notice any thoughts or feelings that arise. Observe them without judgment, allowing them to pass like clouds in the sky. Gently redirect your attention back to your breath. Continue breathing deeply for a few minutes. When you are ready, gently open your eyes. Carry this sense of presence with you throughout your day. Section 7. Escaping the traps of time. The past is gone and the future is yet to come. The only real time is now. When we dwell on past regrets or future anxieties, we lose ourselves in the illusions of time. We must learn to release the past and embrace the present. Past regrets can weigh us down, creating a sense of guilt and shame. It's important to acknowledge our past mistakes, learn from them, and then let them go. The past cannot be changed, but we can choose to live fully in the present. Future worries can create anxiety and stress. We may become consumed by what ifs and worst case scenarios. It's important to plan for the future, but we must not allow our anxieties to steal the joy of the present moment. Practice acceptance of what is. Resist the urge to control or change things that are beyond your control. Embrace the present moment as it is, with all its imperfections. This acceptance creates space for peace and serenity. Section 8. Savouring the present moment. The present moment is a gift. It is filled with beauty, wonder and possibility. When we are fully present, we can appreciate the simple joys of life. We can savour the taste of our food, the warmth of the sun, the laughter of loved ones. Take a moment to appreciate the beauty of nature. Notice the vibrant colours of flowers, the intricate patterns of leaves, the majesty of mountains. Connect with the natural world and feel a sense of awe and wonder. Cultivate gratitude for the good things in your life. Appreciate your health, your relationships, your opportunities. Expressing gratitude can shift our focus from what we lack to what we have fostering a sense of contentment. Engage in activities that bring you joy. Spend time with loved ones. Pursue your hobbies. Immerse yourself in creative expression. When we are engaged in activities we love, we naturally become more present. Section 9. Integrating presence into daily life. Integrating presence into daily life is a continuous journey. It requires conscious effort and practice. Start by incorporating small moments of mindfulness throughout your day. Take a few deep breaths before starting a task. Pay attention to your senses while eating or take a mindful walk during your lunch break. Create a designated space for mindfulness practice. This could be a quiet corner in your home, a peaceful spot in nature or a dedicated meditation room. Having a designated space can help you establish a regular practice and deepen your connection to the present. Surround yourself with reminders of presence. This could be a quote, an image or an object that inspires you to stay grounded in the now. These reminders can serve as gentle nudges to bring you back to the present moment throughout your day. Reflect on your progress and celebrate your successes. Acknowledge the positive changes you experience as you cultivate presence. This self-reflection can help you stay motivated and committed to your practice. Section 10. The Continuing Journey of Now 
The journey of presence is ongoing. There will be times when you get distracted, lost in thought, or caught up in the dramas of life. This is perfectly normal. The key is to gently redirect your attention back to the present moment without judgment. Cultivating presence is not about achieving a state of perfect stillness or eliminating all thoughts. It's about learning to be more aware of our thoughts and emotions without getting carried away by them. It's about learning to live more fully in the now. Each moment is an opportunity to begin again. No matter how many times you get distracted, you can always choose to return to the present. The power of now is always available to you. Embrace the present moment with open arms. Allow yourself to be fully present with whatever arises, whether it's joy, sorrow, excitement or peace. The present moment is all we ever have. It is the gateway to a more fulfilling and meaningful life. And if you like this video, do not forget to subscribe and follow the Psychology and Physical Training channel for more videos. Thanks for joining me today on this journey.